Hey everybody, it's Ori from Astro Web, and wanted to create this quick video of something we just did yesterday, and I've just been thinking about it just a little bit. Um, so it, the topic for today is how to optimize um, or how to speed up a little bit more your your website that has a database, and what you should do kind of fairly regularly. Um, and so it's a s simple thing you probably know about it, or or it's a pretty simple thing. So what you want to do is log into PHP My Admin. And every now and then, once a week, once a month, once every few months, you want to optimize with the set with the tools that PHP MyAdmin has in order to kind of speed it up a little bit. So uh, step one, you want to always back up your database before you do any kind of changes. So always make sure you have backups. Step two, log into PHP MyAdmin um, and just go to your the, the the database you want. So this is the test, for example, and uh, basically, select all of your tables or one by one, whatever you want. Check all and go to the drop down here um, and just click on repair table. Okay. <clears throat> so what it's going to do? It's going to try to you know fix some table, some some information that's that's bad. You'll and you'll see kind of the messages of if it was successful here or not. Um, and then what you want to do? You want to go again to the structure. Again, select everything. Check all and click on optimize okay so very simple tools built-in tools that come with it um, and then uh, you know so hopefully your your database your website will run a little bit quicker it's good to do it every now and then you know again depending on what you, you think is correct um, and one more tip which we like to do is look for a maybe a log table something that keeps either temporary information or some logs and every now and then just delete them or or sort them out, or, or you know, minimize it. So some websites' logs can tables can be very, very big, and it might uh, spend a little more resources um, for your website or your server to use. So try to clean them up every now and then, and then obviously repair and optimize your table every now and then. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions, and the future videos will include some information about more detailed. Um, optimization of the, of your MySQL que queries and and the database and stuff like that. Okay, uh, thank you again. Bye bye.